<laughs> hey, Zoo family, we are on our way to vote. It's midterms here in America. And if you're American, you're like, yo, I know exactly what that means again. Another political cycle. And if you're from somewhere else in the world, you probably have some kind of empathy for that. Anyways, I don't mean to be a downer. It is a blessing. It is a privilege. It is an earned right by, uh, by our forefathers to be able to be free and live in a democratic republic where we have the opportunity to choose Republi uh, Republicans. <laughs> representatives is what I meant to say where we have the opportunity and the right the privilege to choose representatives in a representative government so we're on our way to the polls now it's about midday we're hoping they're kind of empty and we're taking the kids along hey, gonna teach them about their civic duty I think Melanie took Caleb when he was still in a stroller I know I He's feel like a little baby I feel like um, He's a baby. Yeah, baby, baby. You would have had to. I would have been at work, so in order to vote, she would have had to take Caleb. And then I think every single year she's taken Caleb, and then we started to take the older kids. It's a good homeschool program. Uh, yeah, it's a good, a good civics lesson, right? So we told the kids that we're voting on um, governor of our state. We're voting on senator. We're voting on local House. city positions. We're voting on like twelve or thir thirteen amendments that are up for vote this year. Like, wow, we had to do a lot of reading on the practice yeah. ballot. We actually had to practice to vote. And, uh, but that way we go in there, we already we remember everything. We're very clear on what we're voting for, no accidental votes. Um, so uh, we're headed there now. Kids excited? <laughs> Excuse me, I'm sweaty is what I am. <laughs> okay, the air's on, the air's on back there. No, is everyone excited? Yeah, I didn't think so. It's civics. Like, how do you teach that to a kid? Here we are. Look at all the signs. You know you got to a polling. Oh, we're voting Trace. Yeah, we're voting Trace. Keep Trace. Woo! Woo! La Rosa. Trace, look at that. Look at that orange. So much for coming when we thought the polls were empty. This place is packed. We had to park way out so here in the boonies. So we're um we're going in now. Yeah. You got your ID, Mama? I do. Okay, we're not going to be able to video inside the polling place, but uh, we wanted you to see as much of the experience as possible. There's some baseball fields over there. Oh, that's nice. Really close to the house. We live in a wonderful area. We truly do. Hey, come on, kids. In every category, and then we get to vote for our amendments. And look how many you amendments see that? there are. They're amazing. What? So listen, sass. you know how our troops what? are sassy. You're sassy. all over the world trying I'm to protect sassy. us? This You're sassy. Sassy. Vote. sassy. You're so sassy. Because we sassy, vote. sassy. <laughs> because to honor the sacrifice that they have made. What? Katie, this is called a ballot. All of this, we have to vote for, okay? And some of them are like a yes or a no, or you're voting for a person, a person to be the governor, or... Um, people, people that go into okay, Washington, wait a second, I'm having flashbacks to a Our previous Academy. video. Do you remember me telling you about Prime Minister Modi? Yes. Remember, yeah, remember yes. Modi? Yes. Okay, <laughs> Modi is Prime Minister, right? Okay, just like him, there's people in government and we vote for them. In America, we get to that, vote. That's for how they get want. hired. That's how they get hired. Okay. We people vote. I actually don't know a lot about Indian government. I'm sorry. It's you can tell me down in the comments. How does it work with your prime minister? Is he appointed? Is he elected by the people? Is there voting? Please be careful uh, how you answer. Let's not offend other people in the comments. If uh, if you think it happens differently, like. I know there's people in America. If I asked Americans, are your officials elected? Some of them would say, oh no, they're chosen. It's all done behind closed <laughs> doors and, and give me like that kind of answer. So tell me about your government and your country, actually. That's a good question of the day. Let me be your shot, too. Let me be your shot. Let me be your shot. I'm right behind you, Daddy. Hey, Daddy. Let me. Daddy, you know it's recording. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> are you gonna do anything or you just wanna be in the shot? I wanna be in the shot. <laughs> Give it. No, yeah, yeah, live up. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. <laughs> so we came back from voting and the kids got to vote. They got to do this little, um, it's like a pseudo sample little type of ballot and it looks just like the one mom and dad get, but uh, it doesn't have real names on it. They're not voting for the real names of the actual people running for office this time around. It has things like president and vice president. The options are Chuck Roast. First name Chuck, last name Roast. Cassie Roll. 
And then you have United States Senator, the people running our Samage, Sam Midge, Samage, Danish, Al Almond, Almond. You guys are rubbing my head really hard. So, anyways, there's all sorts of cute names, and they all got to vote. What we're gonna do is we're gonna tally up those names. I've actually already tallied up those names, and uh, and we're gonna announce who won all of these important, important offices: President, and U.S. Senator, Governor, Lieutenant Governor. Attorney General, Chief Financial Officer, and Commissioner of Agriculture. I mean, this is important stuff. Right? No. The president you chose with 50... <laughs> you can hear all their voices. <laughs> the winner for pre the president with 50% of the vote, Chuck Roast. Who voted for Chuck Roast? Me. You? Me. And you, okay. For U.S. Senator. With 50% of the vote, Danish. Can you me? Was it? Okay. Yes. And next for governor. This happens in real life. There was a tie for governor. Governor was a tie between vintage modern and salmon calcium. And that was 50%, 50%, which means there has to be a runoff election. Do you know what a runoff is, guys? No. It means there's another election. Ow. And the people have to actually choose now between two candidates or something like that. So, and then we had the attorney general, which is just in time, fifty percent. Who who Are voted you? for just in time? Not me. me. I, I, know, oh. I know. I did not. You did not. I don't know. You don't know? Yeah. Logan, was it you? I, just in time. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Some of us are forgetting who they voted me. for. You did. The CFO was Andy Warhol. I don't know how that name was on there. <laughs> Andy me. Warhol. Andy Everyone Warhol. but Katie voted for Andy Warhol. 75% of the vote. Commissioner of Agriculture was another runoff. It's a 50-50 swing between Frank Lee and Wanda Ring. That's wandering. Wanda Ring. Frankly, frankly, Frank Lee. 50%. So that was a runoff. That's going to have to be another revote. Like there's going to have to be another election. By the way, there was a there was a cute thing that happened. Timmy wrote in his own name first. And he wrote, his in, wrote in his own name for attorney general. You guys see how there's this blank line here? How yeah. you can actually do a write-in? Well, Timmy wrote in his own name, so Timmy tried to be the attorney general, but two of you wrote, voted for just in time, so Timmy didn't get to be the attorney general. Aww. So that is it. You guys voted. Does everyone have their sticker? Yeah. Yes. Yeah? Everyone? Right you don't? What happened to it? I lost it. You lost it? Already? Okay, two of you have it. T Logan, you have yours? Uh-huh. Good job, all the boys still have theirs. It's good that you have your sticker on. In America, like you might go vote during your lunch break at work or your work has to actually <laughs> let you go, give you a break somehow to go vote if you need to do that during the day. And uh, you'll it's very common around like the American workplace that on election Tuesday, you see people wearing their I Voted sticker when they come back from the polls or if they go in the morning, they wear it to work or if you go after work, you wear it home and, and it's just a really common thing. You always slide your ballot in and get your sticker. So we got our stickers and they got stickers because they, they got to participate. Yes. They don't sell candy. You're gonna share, yeah, we are gonna share candy, but that's coming up in another video. We are gonna share our candy, right guys? Yeah. With some very important people, but you have to watch our next video to find out. How about we do a like, subscribe, comment, and share? Like, subscribe, comment, share, and then Don't forget to, and then, okay. And then we all say, don't forget to tag mm -hmm. the hidden zoo animal, which that would be hard, and then we all say bye. No. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. Like, subscribe, comment, <laughs> share. Like, subscribe, comment, share. And don't forget to hit the join button. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.